Steph from Radio BDC at Boston Calling. Day three, final day, and I am with the Box Tiger. Woo! Yeah. Hey. Yeah. hey, girl, hey. Hey. Some hey, enthusiasm, Tila. guys. <laughs> Woo! Hey, girl. Day three. Hey. You guys are here a little different than most bands. Tell us how you got to Boston Calling. We won a competition on Sonic Bids. And whose idea was that? Uh, a fan of ours was like, hey, you should totally apply for this. And we're like, oh, it's only 10 bucks? Okay, totally. And then we did. And now we're here. Look at us. Is this the biggest stage you guys ever played? Easily. Yeah, yeah probably. Yeah, question. 100%. Biggest festival we ever played, yeah. Yeah. A little nervous or no? I oh, wasn't. Last minute nerves. Yeah. Last minute yeah. shaky. There was like yeah. a, an instant. Actually, Cam and I were like, let's listen to that song again. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> and you we sat down with his phone and we're like. Your own song? Our own yeah. song. Your own song? It's just, you know, you start questioning yourself. It's like when you go into a test and you're like, okay, cool, I know all this stuff. I go like, into a test knowing I don't know it. And oh, and how do you do? That's what I did. I mean, I, I didn't mean, do well yeah. in high school, fine. so that's probably the answer. All right, yeah. bad comparison then. Bad <laughs> metaphor. Uh, Either way, it was good. We made it through. It was a lot of fun. Did I, I messed up the last song, but shh. Did you? I didn't, I didn't did. notice. No, see, there you go. Because I was next to your biggest fan who was yelling so loud, I don't think I could notice. Yeah, oh, what's up, capital G? Yeah, give him a shout out. Get it. Capital G. Going on. He's somewhere around here, I'm sure. He's probably streaming it right now. He's probably just out there yelling the Box Tiger over and over. Probably. Yeah. Again. probably. Other people's sets. Classic capital G. What it's is your right. favorite part about being a band at a festival this weekend? Uh, Where do we begin? Now, Lauren's like, Jordan, what about all the free stuff? And I said, yes, I love free water every day. But there's just been lots of really nice people. I was a little nervous because every other band here um, was selected by Boston Calling, um, and then we were, uh, we applied um, to play, and we were ultimately selected, but it was like a little bit different yeah. versus like, you can choose anyone in the world you want, and they're like, here's the bands that really want to play, we got selected by that, and I was a little nervous coming in that uh, we might get treated a little bit differently, not poorly, but just... <laughs> Oh, Get the little guys, come on in, it's all right. But everyone's been extremely professional, helpful. Like, our artist liaison, like, I'd be like, oh, he's probably, gonna, he'll probably be here in like 25 minutes. We'll just sit around and like get our stuff ready. 20 seconds later, he's like, hey man, you needed me? And I've been like, wow, I've never <laughs> been great. in a place like this where everyone's so good and professional and nice and helpful. Yeah. Uh, what's the band you're most looking forward to seeing? Modest Mouse. Brand new. Brand new is yeah. a big one. Brand new and Modest Mouse. Oh, and Tegan Bastille and Sarah. as of Tegan like the past Sarah. little, <laughs> the we're past gonna, little we're while. We're going to rock out together. We're going to do this. Yeah. We'll time. do some dancing. Embarrassing. Embarrassingly. Yeah. So I figured because why not, I was going to read some superlatives and you have to decide who in the band is most likely to fit this superlative. Oh, Jordan, I have a Jordan, list of five. Jordan, Jordan, Jordan. Yeah. <laughs> so number one, most likely to ask another band to take a selfie with them. Lauren, Lauren Chan. Chan. Yeah, Lauren. Lauren. Yeah. You're naming yourself. Yeah. Fanboy now, Lauren Chan. We Chan. say that, but we can't confuse that from Cam taking a selfie at the literally the last show we played. He found the basis for the weaker dance was randomly at yeah. this venue. Yeah. bartending or something. Yeah. <laughs> and he was like, hey, man, are you the basis from the weaker dance? And he was like, uh, yeah, I am. And Cam was like, uh, can I get a picture with you? And made it, it took a selfie. <laughs> yep. That's so, as much as it is Lauren, it's also yeah. Cam. Have you, asked That's any, a share. have you asked anyone for a selfie? Uh, not yet, but actually one time we played in Boston and this guy came up to us. He's like, hey, you guys are from Toronto? My uncle, like, my uncle's the coach of the basketball team there. I was like, what? I'm like, you're Dwayne Casey's nephew? I was like, can I get a picture with you? We got this great picture of me, Jordan, you were there, and Steph. Dwayne Casey's nephew. But that oh, was yeah. at Tichi's. I that do was remember that. Yeah, yeah, but I it was weird that. because we were like, hey, and he was like, yeah, let's go. And he like had his pose and he was like ready to do that. He's like, yeah, this happens all the time. He's, he's done this a million this times. Yeah. yeah. All right. Next superlative. Most likely to be late to the show because they're raiding the catering. Jordan. 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 Yeah. <laughs> Jordan. I guess yeah. so. Yeah. All you can all you can eat oysters. Well, I know. Wait, if, if it's There's all you can eat oysters, then it's probably me. Oh, yeah. But you know, all you can eat chicken fingers and <laughs> pretzels. We heard yeah. late and we thought Which Jordan. It was. Most likely to be one of those people who wear floral crowns to a festival. Floral Don't crown, say me. I guess. And Don't it would have to be Sonia. I guess. <laughs> Why? I guess. Cam, Cam or myself, we have. Uh, I think you would all look very pretty. We'd yeah. all look good. Before. I think Jordan, we're all good. I think you would look very pretty in a. Floral. But I don't. But I'm not the most likely one. Okay, good point. I've got all a right. massive forehead. I would probably shoddy it just to try to hide <laughs> hide some of that. I got the room. I can just fit it in there and be like, all right, cool. 
I'm most likely to try and start a game of hacky sack in the middle of the crowd. Oh, Cam. Yeah, I, 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 I'm terrible at hacky sack. But, but you would try. But I, I love crowds. Totally One of our, our, our techs today, she came up to me and she was like, oh man, I can't believe I didn't bring a hacky sack. <laughs> Wait, really? So I guess uh, our friend Maya, she was an uh, honorary band member. It says artist on her badge, so her. I'm sure there's somewhere in that crowd that you can steal one from, probably. Yeah, oh, for sure. And the last one is, what was the last one? Most likely to not know any of the bands, but pretend they do. <laughs> yes. What? <laughs> she no. knows the bands today, yeah. but as no. far as other ones, because I'm always like, hey, man, you you guys were cool. Yeah. How That's are like, you? Have you guys seen the, um, no. Oh, what's it, Jimmy Kimmel, where they like go to Coachella? Oh, and yeah. they got the band. What do you think of, like, Tin Can, like, death metal? And they're like, yeah, yeah but that was a yeah. big band. That I like their old video. stuff yeah. better. That one's That's me. Because it's just Sarah Silverman overdubbing. But uh, there was one they did last week with, like, Godzilla. And then I was like, well, I think again. But then at the end, they bring the last girl in the video out, like, on stage. And because she, she thought Godzilla was real. And she's just, like, this girl who's, like, clearly, like, I just didn't know. Like, she wasn't, like, she didn't seem like an actress. She, like, seemed I like a real person. Know. Like, I, I mean, I know now. She yeah. just seems so embarrassed. Oh, my God. Um, that's on national television. Okay, that is not me. <sighs> well, I'm going to say. Okay. All right, final superlative. Most likely to leave their soap at someone's house two times in a row. Uh, me. Jordan. Jordan. Yeah, yes. You've done that at my house. Jordan. You definitely left your soap. Oh, did you leave your soap there again? <laughs> oh, yeah. I have your soap in my bag. Oh, there we go. That's classic. Uh, it was body washed the first time. Well, this time it's not swagger, swagger. Yeah, no more. Old Spice, Spice swagger. Body body Maybe body you can get sponsored by them next time. Old Spice swagger. All right, Old Spice. Like a sponsor. Happening. Well, Box Tiger, thank you for stopping you. by Radio thank BDC. You. And Radio BDC will be at Boston Calling for the rest of the day. Woo, woo. Full coverage at boston.com slash radio. Thanks. Thanks, guys. Yeah. Thank you.